some background about this story. In the Exodus story, in the Hebrew Bible, an enslaved Hebrew family puts their baby in a basket and sends him down the Nile River in order to keep him safe from the Pharaoh, the cruel king of Egypt. The baby is found and taken from the river by the Pharaoh's own daughter, who adopts the baby and calls him Moses. When Moses grows up, he leads his people out of slavery in Egypt to their promised land. Baby Moses in a Basket, written by Karen Yakowitz, illustrated by Julie Downing. Baby Moses in a Basket, floating down the Nile. Baby Moses in a Basket, slowly sailing for a while. Curious Ibis in the water comes to take a closer peek, sees a baby, little baby, kicking tiny baby feet. Basket drifting to the shallows, catches near the reedy shore. Gently, Ibis sets it free to sail a while more. Among the boats and floating barges, past the green papyrus reeds, baby Moses on a voyage where the River Nile leads. Mama Hippo, like a mountain, rises upward from the deep, follows baby, baby Moses, as he dozes off to sleep. Mama Hippo nudges softly, helps the basket skim along, watching over baby Moses so that nothing will go wrong. Little baby sweetly dreaming, Mama Hippo as his guide, down the river, through fast currents, basket rocking side to side. High above, the storm clouds gather, up beyond the swelling Nile. Far below, from river's bottom, rises mighty crocodile. Swiftly gliding, steering baby, thrashing through the seething storm, keeping baby, baby Moses, snug and safe, dry and warm. Whirling water swirling around them, currents roaring even more, plunging through the wild waters toward the calm of sandy shore. Baby Moses in a basket floats among the reeds and flowers near the Pharaoh's daughter, bathing in the pale good morning hours. Baby Moses stirs and whimpers in his basket on the Nile. What? A baby? Oh, sweet baby! cries the maiden with a smile. Up she lifts him, full of wonder. I drew you from the river deep. You are safe now in my arms. Close your eyes. Go back to sleep.